In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the trim tool. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start by creating a sketch. I'm going to use the front plane here. Uh, when I'm done with that, I'm going to get rid of these planes because I don't need to see them. So I'm going to hide those. And I'm going to go ahead and click on the front of my cube so I get a good view of my sketch in 2D. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just create some basic shapes. I'm going to show you how the trim tool works. Uh, the trim tool is located right here. Okay. Um, I wouldn't worry about using any of those features. I would just click on the main button, which is going to get you trim. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and create a basic shape here. Here's a rectangle. Um, I can create another shape that might just be right off my rectangle. And now you can see that I have areas that are intersecting between the shapes. And I just want it to be one full shape. So I can go ahead and click on the trim tool. And notice when I highlight a line, it's going to say, do you want to basically delete that part of the line? I say, yes, I do. So I'm going to click on it. And you'll notice as I click, it's going to get rid of those lines. And so now when I try to extrude it, this is just going to be one shape here. Uh, same works for uh, other, other tools. I can do the line tool here. Okay, so... I make a line tool like that. I can actually trim away the stuff that I don't want on the outside as well. So if I trip, click on the trim tool, I can get rid of that as well. So that no longer will be extended. Uh, I do not have to worry about that dot there. Uh, that's not going to be an issue. Okay. So when I'm done, I can now extrude. I can uh, revolve it. And I can make that shape as is.